Welcome back, everyone. One person was pronounced dead, and five others were critically injured during that collapse that happened this afternoon in New York City. So we're being told that this investigation now continues. We want to thank my uncle, Siapa Lewis, for covering that news story for us tonight. In other top stories here on this Tuesday, Fox News reaches a settlement worth up to over $700 million. The Dominion took place earlier this morning, so Fox News said they apologized, but it could have been better at this time. The only reason why I watch Fox is because of the NFL, the NCAA, along with everything else. They used to have NHL back in the 1995-1996 season. Maybe they can bring it back for modern times. This is what Fox News is saying. They're saying, in a quote, we acknowledge the court's rulings finding things about the Dominion to be false. We are less than an hour away to file the taxes. The deadline is at midnight. Normally, tax day is held on April 15th. But to be honest, though, it was on a Saturday this year. And Emancipation Day was held as of Monday. So many people might see smaller refunds beginning this year. And still ahead here on CBS News Philadelphia, the latest on the rest of the top stories. A friendly reminder to everyone, you can find CBS News Philadelphia through Pluto TV, CBS News, or anything else. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back in just a couple minutes. So give me time. Don't go away. 